Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel Tech and Art. Hope you guys are doing good. Today I'm going to discuss about SQL Server logins automation process. Okay, so before starting the session, I would request to each and everyone who ever newly joined on my channel, please like, do subscribe, and don't forget to share. Please press press the bell icon so that you can get the new video notification. Okay, and uh, uh, you can join the by clicking the join button uh, as a member. Okay, so we'll get the benefit to you know. Uh, directly you can reach out to me and uh, have some privileged for the join member so you can join it by clicking the join button okay and uh, so the today scenario is basically uh, in a some critical application uh, you need to create a sql server logging by you know uh, some restriction okay so when i said the restriction so when whenever you create a sql server logging okay by using the password so there are option you can you know uh, skip the you enforce password policy and either you can enable it okay but in some critical application it's mandatory to enable the you know uh, the password enforce policy so in that situation you need to uh, keep a track you know for the password expiry because you know uh, either you need to keep a track or you need to send a notification to application owner or mostly it's application users responsibility to keep a track uh, for their respective application why because if password will be expired and they are not going to change okay so all the automated jobs whatever the jobs running from the application side it will be failed or it is a production server then it's very very risky so all the production server it's mandatory to you know uh, keep a track for password expiry policy and before expiry you should go with the all the you know correct approved approach whatever the approach for respective projects like uh, it's a required to ch uh, raise a change for uh, you know uh, reset the password or something so you can go with that approach okay so but today i am going to show you how we can you know find easily okay so let me connect my name is studio so whenever you you know create a or uh, sql server logins okay so sys dot logins will give the exact information but uh, that script will not give the exact overview about the password expiry and the lease date and all so i am going to share this script to you guys it's, this is very very helpful to day to day activity and i i'm going to run right away and you can see the benefit of this script okay so once you click the execute you will see the column like login name password last time set you know days until the expiration password expiration and lot of things is there which is very very helpful you can uh, you can use it why it's not coming because i don't have any login so let me create a login with the password enforce policy okay one second uh, so right click go to login and let me create login like my login okay and it's a sql server as i told you authentication and i will give you the some password okay and it's by default enforced so here i am only talking about in a some application you can uncheck it there is not mandatory to enforce the password policy but in some application critical application it's mandatory to enforce the password policy but the microsoft recommendation also is you can enforce the password policy so you can use it okay so now click on okay as you can see my login is created now you can execute the same script as you can see the my login is created the password last time reset it's a uh, you know uh, the date it's coming okay time it's coming and you can see the expiration also is the same why uh, i will tell you the things and is a policy checked yes zero day expiration why because as just now i have created if you go and try to log in this newly created login let me log in this now you can see the it is asking to reset the login why because while creating the login it was uh, you know uh, check the first time when you are you logged in you need to reset uh, you know reset the login uh, credential 
so i'm going to change this logins password again because password enforce policy enable so that's the reason yep i can create i can connect it okay as you can see here my logins okay now you can execute the same script now you can say now we have a 42 days okay from now 42 days this logins password expiration date okay so now this data you need to save it in a, your monthly uh, you know tracker activity or or you can you can share to the application owner also sometimes uh, application users response not sometimes mostly they need to keep a track for their respective application they will come to us okay uh, for finding the exact expiration date because they need to schedule a change or whatever the process okay so for the exact date and all they they will come to us okay tell me the this particular login the the password expiration when it will be going to expire so you can based on this script output you can share to them or exact details so this is very much helpful uh, script i just want to share to you guys okay so i will put this script to description you can utilize it this is very much helpful to day to day activity okay and if you are getting the help as i told you uh, don't forget to subscribe and you can click on join button uh, for such kind of more script and all related you can directly reach out to me so whoever the join member only can get the benefit okay so i will share the i will try to share my best effort okay so well that's it for today if you like the video please press the like button okay we'll meet you soon thank you guys